Thank you for checking out my YouTube channel, Emblem Emporium. I also have an eBay store called Emblem Emporium, and I have a direct link to that on my channel information. This is just a small sample of the types of things that I sell. I mostly sell vintage European and Japanese uh, emblems, that's what I specialize in, but occasionally I do sell other things besides emblems, such as interior parts or exterior parts, grills, hubcaps, or anything else that you might um, re request from me. You can directly request an item from me, and if I can find it, I'll get it for you. Uh, just a quick uh, rundown of what I have here as an example, some Jaguar emblems. Um, I'll be very honest with you, I operate my business by the golden rule. I will not ask you to buy anything that I, w I would not buy myself uh, at a price that I would not pay for it. Uh, just for an example, these Jaguar emblems are in pretty good uh, condition. I will probably ask about in the neighborhood of around oh, eighteen, twenty dollars for that depending on the rarity and just how good of, a, of condition it's in. These Jaguar Venom Plast emblems, you'll see that there's a little bit of the chrome missing on these. Uh, I will not. I would not charge twenty dollars for these, and I would tell you uh, in the product description exactly what is wrong with it. These Jaguar emblems here, this fender emblem, steering wheel emblem, and grill emblem, they're in pretty overall decent condition. But you'll find here that maybe the chrome's missing a little bit. I'll tell you that too. I've sold these in the past. Some of these in uh, very good condition um, for about twenty dollars. And I also sell individual emblems too, as you might have guessed. I will not sell only complete sets. Sometimes folks need just one emblem, and I can sell that to them as well. Uh, Dotson emblems, um, I've sold a few of these, as well as Dotson 280ZX emblems. Usually those don't last very long. And Honda is very popular. Again, I'll tell you, if the tabs are intact, they're not always intact. Sometimes they come off. Um, but it's it's still a good emblem to have. You can mount it with a strong adhesive or double-sided 3M tape. Uh, 1970s uh, Mercedes uh, emblems, they do come with a uh, 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 bolt and washer in the back, the nut and washer in the back. Um, Alfa Romeo horn cap. I, again, I'll be very honest with you if something is not in perfect condition. This is not in perfect condition. You could probably use a good cleaning, some armor all. My prices do reflect uh, the condition it's in. I'll be very fair with you. I'll tell you if it needs to be uh, cleaned or maybe reconditioned. Uh, 